After working our way across Java to Bali, it was time to fly to the less touristy island of Sulawesi. Sulawesi is a huge island known for its remote areas and fascinating culture. Come with us today as we explore Makassar, the largest city in Sulawesi, before taking an overnight bus to Taraja. Tell me and be honest, tell me did you know that you would be leaving me just like the winter snow? Tell me and be honest, tell me should I know that you'd be leaving me so pain? We're in Makassar! Makassar! Yeah. Not for very long, just to No, leave. <laughs> yeah. We have a bus, overnight bus late tonight. To the Raja, yeah. Because of some visa things. Yeah. But we are trying to find some coffee right now. Yeah. And then we're going to explore the whole city in one day. Hopefully, yeah. we can see a lot. Hopefully, I yeah. I think this is the cafe. Yeah. La Coupe Patisserie. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I didn't check my phone, but I'm pretty sure. I don't know. This banana bread looks so good though, and carrot cake looks so good. Everything. Are you excited? Yeah, it's so cute here, no? It's so cute! Yeah. We went there. Yeah, we did go there. Together. And we got our first call. I'm eating the foam, it's all good. <laughs> That's our avocado toast! It looks so good. Yeah, it does. We just had to put more money on our phones because now we're in Sulawesi. Yeah. We ran out of data. <laughs> it's not that expensive though. It's only yeah. 60,000. Right yeah. How is it? It's so good. Carlos is eating without me. I want half. It's better than the one in Bali. Yeah. yeah. It actually it looks so good because it's like smashed avocado and slices. We're leaving. Yeah, yeah. It was so good, yeah. And now we literally have to cross the street and we're at the first place we're going today. Oh look at that. It's cute in the middle of the road. There's a cool thing in the middle oh we should have crossed then. Oops. <laughs> There's a cool statue in the middle of the road. All this street food and here is the fort. We're walking next to Fort Rotterdam Makassar which is a 17th century Dutch fort here in the middle of Makassar. Yeah. It's supposed to be turned into a museum now, um, but you can even from outside here see like all the buildings. They're super like Dutch looking. Yeah, it looks very European and all. Yeah, I guess we have to pay to enter maybe down here. Oh, yeah. there's people like on the wall. That's cool. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go in here first and then work our way down along the beach because Makassar is right next to the beach and check out all the other cool stuff. But yeah. first, here, Fort Rotterdam, Bentang Ujung Padang, Pandang. Is this the entrance? There's a lot of buses here. Oh, there's a bunch of other foreigners. Yeah. It's not only us. Oh, there's a whole group of like old foreigners. I'm pretty sure they are from the Netherlands. Yeah, they're probably Dutch. <laughs> Name? Name? Profession. Country? Oh, so the profession here. Ah, Profe profession. Ah. That's pain, man. <laughs> profession. So we just came inside. A guide's talking to Carlos. Um, we had to fill out a book with like our name and where we're from and our profession, but there's no ticket. You don't have to pay to enter. So we can just walk around and check out here. There's like tons of kids, school groups, I guess, and a guy, guides if you want guides. We're just gonna try and run around here quick and see what we see. Fort Rotterdam is one of the most famous attractions in Makassar. It was the Dutch headquarters until the 1930s and is one of the best preserved Dutch buildings in all of Indonesia. Do you feel like you're in Sulawesi? Or the Netherlands. <laughs> the Netherlands? Yeah, the guy was speaking Spanish perfectly. Yeah. Here's a cannon. What is in here? Wow, very dark. Are you surprised we didn't have to pay? Yeah. Seriously, this is so cool. Actually, it's super big. Yeah. And it, it does look like Dutch. And it's so old. I can't get over how old. Like 17th century. That's crazy. 
So here there's a sign, only in Indonesian. But we translated it and it says, this building is the oldest building in all the buildings here at the fort. And it was built in 1686. So that's crazy. The residence of Cornelius Spielman. There's another Indonesian facts here that say this building has typical Dutch architecture and it was built by a bomb. Hit, it was hit by a bomb. So they reconstructed it in 1994. Yeah, you can go up here on the wall. The Bastion Bone. This is exciting. Are you impressed? It is nice. Yeah. It is. We are at the edge of the wall. What can you see? Whoa. The cafe we ate at? <laughs> yeah. And the ocean. Over here you should be able to see the ocean. A little, yeah, here. Ocean. We're the only ones coming on this part of the wall <laughs> to sneak around the frontier and get to the other side. It's so well conserved though. It is, really. It's insane to think, how, how old is this? If that one was built in 16 something, it's over 300 years old. 300. Who might be the, the fort in Manila? Manila, they have like the same. There's a fort in Manila, yeah. Yeah, for Spanish people, but yeah, it's huh. big. So how this one is Dutch, that one is Spanish? Spanish? Yeah. Museum here, 10,000 for foreigners. Yeah, but we've been walking around and you didn't have to pay for that, so that's yeah. good. Then we just pay here. You have 20? I do have 20. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Provinci Sulawesi Selatan. Smell like old. Yeah. Like, yeah. Oh, it's in English, I'm at least here. Nice. An old, old carriage and a bicycle. It's so Dutch. <laughs> wow. The museum has an upstairs, and here's some old guns. Yeah. And a sword. And a sword, yeah. That sword looks very, very old. What are they from? It doesn't colonial say. Area. The colonial era, yeah. Some cannonballs, a crazy old gun. Is this a crown? Oh, look at that sword. Oh, fancy. Wow. Here's like the ones that we saw at um, Taman Mini. Yeah. But they're so small. They're only this big. I assumed they'd be like the oh, size of us. These are the small ones. Yeah. yeah? They're bigger than that. Yeah. And so human statues. The Polynesia type of statues. Made of stone, wood, clay. Look very simple. They were found in ancient tombs in South Sulawesi and functioned like gravestones. I want to see these so bad in real life. Carlos, if we get our visa extended, we have to go see these. I know, yeah. I want really, to go. really. They I really look want to go. Same. Yeah. Here we have some little models from Taraja. We're going there tomorrow. Yeah, and we're gonna stay in a homestay that's in one of these houses. I thought this was a boat, but it's not. It's to process rice. The long dimples. All right, we are leaving the fortress. Yep. And we're gonna just walk. It's like 15 minutes to, what is it, Lopsari Beach? Yeah, Ali. I mean, all the places that we want to go are just close here and next to the beach. So yeah. We're going to do everything walking. Mm-hmm. Fully quiet and slow. I try my best to move on. Too late. We're on a famous street in Makassar. Shopping center? Yeah, the Samba Opu Shopping Center Street. We're going to walk down this. Is it a fancy street? I don't know. I don't know what to expect. On the sidewalk? Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, down here 15 minutes and then we'll be close to the beach. So far on this shopping street, we passed a million. Hello. 
Oh, oh, <laughs> we passed a million jewelry places. Yeah. It's like a whole street of jewelry shopping. It's crazy. It is crazy, no? Yeah. Yeah. Huh. This is my only jewelry. I was not expecting this. $2 earrings in Bali. Yeah. yeah. I wasn't expecting this for a shopping Photo street. Shopping. Yeah, same. Here's, so here's the shopping street. But there's such a nice breeze coming from the ocean here. Yeah. So we're going to cut across off the shopping street since we're not buying any gold. Yeah, it looks so nice, the beach. Go Let's the beach. check the beach. Yeah. We got to the beach and we have an amazing view of the 99 Dome Mosque. That's a mosque? Yeah, it's a new mosque. Yeah, there's two mosques here. I was looking up about this one, the 99 Domes Mosque. Apparently it's really new, like I don't... I, I think it's... I think they're still working on it. I don't think it's fully, like 100% finished. But yeah, we have to check that out. And there's a floating mosque here too, which we should be coming up on in a second. Cooler mosque I ever seen. Right? It looks amazing. And there was so I didn't think we'd come out that side street and just walk the mosque. That was really cool. Now we're almost at Losari Beach. Here's a bull. There's a sign that says Taraja with the mosque behind. Here's a Taraja house. There's a statue of some lady. I don't know who. Yeah, this is so neat. Yeah, the mosque still, I can't get over how cool that mosque looks. And here it says City of Makassar. Coolest mosque you've ever seen? Seriously, yeah. so cool. It has 99 of those little domes there. And, and one minaret, no? Right. Yeah, looks like it. Is this Losari Beach here? Yeah, Pantai Losari. I don't know what they're setting up for. Something's happening here. At the beach still, we have some boats there. It's Nelson Mandela, Sheikh Yusuf, and Mahatma Gandhi. So Gandhi, Yusuf, and Mandela. There's another sculpture over there. We're trying to walk this huge loop here the whole way around to the 99 Dome. Oh, there's a lot of people there. Let me zoom in. There are a lot of people at the mosque right now. That would be amazing if that mosque had a tour, like the mosque we saw in Jakarta, and they took us around, because it looks really fancy. And we're coming up here again on another mosque too, the floating mosque. There's so many police here too, it's crazy. I think they're setting up for like a festival, but there's police everywhere. I'm very safe here in Makassar. <laughs> oh, cute. The city of Makassar. There's a bunch of sculptures here. And right behind it here is the floating mosque. A mosque on stilts. So it looks like it's floating. It looks a lot smaller than the other one, but I love the blue. Yeah. It's open? Yeah, I wonder though. Carlos is in shorts. I obviously, my head is not covered. I don't know if we can go in, but we can try. Yeah, even the roof is floating. It's so cute. It's like a cute little mosque. Yeah, when you compare it to the other one, the other one over there is huge. I don't know if there's tourists here. <laughs> The guy words. here, yeah, he spoke English and we said, can we go? And he said, yeah, take off your shoes. And I'm like, without my head covered, everything? He's like, yeah, it's fine. I think we have so, to split though. So it's oh, yeah, one one here and three, yeah, here. Oh, there's people on the ground praying. Mm -hmm. We have to be quiet. I feel weird going in without my head covered though. I might just walk up to the window and leave. actually really small yeah. here but as we left we started talking to these people hey. and the guy spoke really good English yeah. I guess they're from Palopo they're asking what we're doing and we're explaining how we either have one week or one month hopefully one month yeah all the places that we want to see too. yeah they were so nice yeah, right. now we're gonna continue our walk around to the next mosque it's yeah a, a big loop it's like 20 minutes from this mosque around the water to the other mosque the mosque hoping yeah but we're gonna pass something cool on the way first time i've ever seen a floating mosque it's, it's literally floating at a little part here, there's so many statues of, I guess, famous people from Makassar. Some of them have names. This one doesn't have a name. His name's missing. But there's a lot. They're here, 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 here. Everywhere. So many famous people in Makassar. And here, 
there's like a giant Taraja house being built on the bridge. I think we're gonna walk under that. My new favorite thing to say in Indonesian is Dalan Dalan. <laughs> Everyone's asking us, what are you doing? And we're like, we're just walking around. Jalan Jalan. Oh, okay. <laughs> but we're at the center of Indonesia. We're at the center point. How cool of is that? Almost. And we yet. think it's really, really the center because we looked at the map and like from Papua to Sumatra, it looks like this is the middle. I think so. That just shows you how huge it is here. Center point of Indonesia. Whoa. We made it. We made it to the center. Yeah. And here's a globe. It says the same thing on the world. Center point of Indonesia. I can't believe we're at the center of Indonesia. Right there. Do you think it's that circle right there is the exact center? Exactly that. Yeah? Yeah. Nice. We're walking over the bridge now. As we were walking down here, some guys asked us to take a picture and we took a picture and we told them our Instagram and look, yeah. they posted our picture. <laughs> <That's> cute. <laughs> cute. Yeah. Hi guys, if you're watching this. <laughs> What's this car doing? They're backing up along next to us. Literally, they're driving backwards on the bridge. <laughs> It's so hot. So, so, so hot. I don't know if we can go in. There's a lot of people here. <laughs> the other one didn't have a lot of people. It's under construction though, still. I think so, yeah. We don't know if we can go in, but we came up the stairs and we took how many pictures already? I don't know. Like a lot 20. of pictures, yeah. <laughs> so we're going to walk around in a circle then. Did you count the domes? Yeah. How many? 99. Yeah? Are you sure? No, but I think so. It's nice though. There's not a lot of people at all. Yeah, no. It's under construction still a little, but like the main thing looks yeah. done. It looks really nice. Yeah. Why well, are you going to try to go inside now? Yeah. We'll try. We'll see what they say. <laughs> We're at the entrance. I don't think we're going to go inside though because Carlos has shorts and I'm not covered, but it looks cool, right? It is so big, yeah. Nice. Nice. All right, yeah, we did not make it inside this one, but we looked through the door. Yeah. I don't know, there's so many people here, so I feel weird just walking in like this. Um, but yeah, it was cool to see the outside. Yeah. We made it here. The building's amazing. It is. It's a must really nice. visit if you're in yeah, Makassar. Yeah, seriously. Especially the first time that we walked out of the street and just poof, the mosque yeah. was there. It looked amazing. Okay, we, we are gonna are try so to thirsty. Yeah, find water and then yeah. go to eat something. Yeah. Maybe gado gado. We didn't eat gado gado for so long. <laughs> yeah. Maybe. maybe. Yeah, and someone told us on Instagram a really good gado gado place here. Yeah. So maybe we'll go check that out because. It is hot. Oh, this is our friend there. <laughs> video. Uh, huh? Are you video? Video? Yeah. Oh, video. With the jaw, you video here. Yeah. Okay. Wait. Show the location. Here? Uh, Barcelona bike. We have to use that bike. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Picture, yeah. Picture. Hello. Picture time. And then we're grabbing a car to go to the restaurant. <laughs> Here? With the kids. Yeah. The kids. Yeah. Hello, hello. We're getting in the car here and we got tons and tons of pictures. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Oh, hitting my head. Wow. <laughs> Time to go. <laughs> we buy mask. Oh, video. Yeah. You're the photographer. Yeah, yeah. Photographer. Barcelona driver. Barcelona. Barcelona. Yeah. Yeah. There's a breeze now though, it's yeah, so nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah. We need aqua though. Aqua, aqua. aqua. Ayer, ayer mineral. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Here, water. Here? Maybe? Yeah? yeah. 
Yeah, here they come. Yeah? Okay. okay. Just tell me and be honest. Tell me, did you know that you would be leaving me just like the winter snow? Tell me and be honest. Tell me, should have known that you'd be leaving Where is the food place? What's it called? I don't know. I don't know either. Something right close to here. I think we're almost there. I should check on my phone. Ratna, this one, no? Ratna? I think here? Yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah Ratna Luita is where someone told us to come eat. So we are here. Woohoo! It's open? Yeah, nice. What are we getting, Carlos? Gado, gado. Gado, gado, We have learned that basar means big. Big. And kesil means small. Yeah. Okay, chill. Yeah, chill. And okay, just chill. rice and tea. Yeah. Ice te tawar, plain iced tea. Yeah. I'm yeah. Excited though. After one week and a half in Bali, why yeah. are you doing gado gado? <laughs> Teas and the gado gado look so good. Oh, Huge. The big one is big. Terumakasi. <laughs> mix it, Carlos. Mix it. Mix everything, yeah. Mix it. Even the crackers. Oh, there's a whole egg oh. there. I want to meet even with the rice. Yeah. I don't know if it is allowed. That's probably very weird. <laughs> but yeah, it looks so good. It looks so good. Okay. You're failing. <laughs> okay. Yeah? yeah? Okay, try it. Is it the best gado gado ever? Oh, it's so good. <laughs> but yeah, it's so good. Mm, maybe we should have got two actually. Now it looks like you have food and I just have rice. Carlos is the one who ordered the rice, not me. I'm gonna put the rice. It was so fast though. It's sort of a potato here since I love it so much. Good? So good. Yeah. I miss my gado gado. Yeah. Okay, I want more. Me too. And I want to mix it with rice. Mm -hmm. I don't care if it's allowed or not. We got a large gado gado rice and two teas, two iced teas for 41. So that is also good. Yeah, it was so good gado gado. So good. Now we're gonna head back to our hotel, try and get some work done before our night to bus to Taraja. We're leaving the store, and here's our ride! Nice! Alright, we're going on the bus now. Yeah. We just went to the bathroom. This is going to be our first long overnight bus without a toilet since Turkey, Turkey like two years ago. Our seats are huge. That's the one good thing, oh, but... It's so creepy. <laughs> this light? Oh. Yeah. But hopefully we sleep, because yeah. we're going to get to Taraja and have to do a lot of stuff. Sure. <laughs> Tell me I'm being honest